every year we clean this place top to bottom. My dear father has a bath, and my darling stepmother changes their underwear. <laughs> well, this year's extra special because, as you can imagine, I'm going to be at the big party, and my dad says that there's going to be lots of young Irish lads who want to dance with me, and maybe, I'm lucky, just maybe, I'll be kissed under the stars by a handsome Limerick lad. And if that all goes well, you can go back to Cayley dancing at the Valley St. Michael Centre. <laughs> oh, but here's my dearest friend in the whole entire world, Morbid Maud. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord, Maud. You look even more morbid and depressed than usual. <laughs> Whatever, Spectre. Oh, I have a bad feeling. <laughs> A bad feeling, <laughs> and I've been hearing bad rumours. Oh, what did I tell you, Maud? Don't listen to the turtle prattle, the brittle prattle and the rumours. It'll just put you in bad humours. Snowy, listen till I tell you. I've just come from the seance with the spirit man at the Valley St. Michael Centre. Yeah, yeah, yeah. More people talking nonsense in Valley St. Michael. Oh, Snowy, the spirit man, he talks sense. He says, your stepmother, oh, she's wicked. She says she's no good for you. Is she, boys and girls? No. She's no good for your daddy. Is she, boys no. and girls? No. Oh, she should be sent to the devil. <laughs> you can't say <see. laughs> Anyway, stepmother Gloria is the most important person in the whole of Valley St. Michael, isn't she, boys and girls? Yeah. Well, apart from Phil Fitzpatrick, of course. Now we are talking. Oh, well. Yeah. And Maureen Morrison. And Patrick Morrison. And Patrick Gall. And but Clint she's Gunn. not even from Valley St. Michael. <laughs> oh, she's just a grave digger. Don't you need gold digger? No. Grave digger. 